Welcome back to Discover Wisconsin's special bed and breakfast episode. Our next stop is Bayfield, where, brace yourself, we're staying at the magnificent Old Rittenhouse Inn, a Victorian beauty built in the 1890s, and it's the perfect place to plan a winter getaway. The ornate woodwork and Victorian decor are handsome. And how's this for heart stirring? A delectable snack plate and hot cocoa before a roaring fire delivered in pretty cups by the innkeeper herself. With 17 fireplaces, there are plenty of spots throughout the B&B for guests to savor those comfy, cozy moments that make Wisconsin winters wonderful. It's the innkeepers who seed the details and make those over-the-top experiences for guests. The spirit of innkeeping is really about wanting to exceed people's expectations and have them leaving a raving fan, you know, just uh, having the best time of their lives. One thing about Wisconsin B&B innkeepers, they always have the best suggestions for places to go and things to see in the area. I'm thrilled to tell you the innkeepers here suggest dog sledding and even call the company Wolf Song to take me. Staying at the old written house would have been enough, but dog sledding too? Who cares that it's four below zero? Back at the inn, it's dinner at the in-house restaurant. The entire first floor has tables throughout each room, and let me tell you, the menu is amazing. I can see why so many people have their weddings and receptions at a B&B. As the day ends, I can't help but think about how great B&Bs are, how wonderful the innkeepers are, and the food. Hmm, well, let's just say I can't wait for tomorrow. Now it's bedtime and I'm gonna sleep well. Good night. The next morning, amid views of icy Lake Superior where vehicles are driving across to Madeline Island, I'm nice and warm enjoying a breakfast fit for a queen. Check this out. Almost too beautiful to eat, right? And it was so good. Then I meet a mother and daughter who come here every year. We came all the way from Utah. Why? Uh, we're here for the Berkey, which is a ski marathon, which is in two days, and we're a little anxious about that, but we come every year. So you guys compete in that? We do. Well, I wouldn't say we complete. We try to finish it. So. <laughs> <laughs> if you love beautiful architecture, out of this world service from innkeepers and food you'll never forget, the Old Rittenhouse is a must stay and just one of many wonderful B&Bs in Wisconsin. This weekend came to an end way too quickly. <sighs> Goodbye, old Rittenhouse Inn. I hope we meet again. To find great bed and breakfast for your next vacation, go to discoverwisconsin.com and click on the Wisconsin Bed and Breakfast Association destination page. When we come back, one of Baraboo's most mesmerizing views at the Inn at Wawanisi Point. Stay with us.